Hi beauties. I'm gonna give you a tour of my my gym and my apartment, okay? So this is where you enter. And we have a like a 3D dimension of a bus. Isn't that cool? Shout out to the person, to the artist that did this. And then we have a full blown weights exercise. Do I use this? I'm gonna be keeping it real. Um, sometime I do and sometime I don't. And then we have this one as well. I use it sometime, okay? And then we have the mirror. Hey, hi, hi. <laughs> I hope y'all doing beautiful, okay? And then we do have these two walking treadmill. Apologize if I'm not saying it right, but remember, no judgment in here. Then we have the bikes. And then some balls. And then we have a mat. I do not use the mat nor the ball. I, when I'm gonna do some weights, I bring my weight down. And I clean, I chose this one right here. I was started to clean it because the rule are that if you use a gym, you're supposed to clean it, okay? Because you don't want no bacteria on your hand or in your body, all right? <laughs> I'm just keeping it real, okay? So I'm gonna log out for now because I need to finish up my cleaning and then I'll come back um, to set the machine and we're gonna do 10 minute or 15 minute, okay? All right. See y'all later. Hi. I'm here already. We're gonna increase the walking, okay? And remember, start slow. Yeah, I don't need to be rushing and do it fast in your own pace. Yep. All right. Remember, disclaimer. Disclaimer, disclaimer. I'm not no fitness instructor. I'm just giving suggestions. Because yeah, I want your body just to not be stiff. It's beautiful outside, sunny. I don't know if I showed y'all that we do have windows in here in our mini little gym, which I'm totally grateful. Do I use it every day? I'm keeping it real. Nope, I don't use it every day. I should use it every day. <laughs> Let me put it a little bit more faster. Start slow and then just build up your speed. Remember, you don't want to hurt your bones. You don't want to hurt your knees or your foot. For those people that have problems with their knees and foot, there's no need to be having it all the way inclined. <laughs> no, you don't need that. You just need movement in those bones. Now, that's it, movement.
And remember to do stretching before you do any kind of exercise, okay? That's the prior clip. I already did my stretching going up and down the stairs because somebody was already here using it. And like I said, we need to respect people's privacy. I could have come in and asked him, you know, explain to him that I'm doing YouTube and that I'm doing a video, but no, I didn't want it to do that. Always respect people's pri privacy, their boundaries. Also set boundaries for yourself as a person, yes. Because that's a part of life skills also, setting boundaries. When you communicate with someone, for those people that don't know, I'm gonna take this opportunity to share some information. Um, this is the winter season, and maybe y'all do know, maybe y'all don't know. Um, and this, where I live, is called CRT program. They help with, um, with the gas and light. In your area, you also could call 211, and they could help you with the bill. The companies also have a matching program, like the Sony, excuse me. They also have a matching program, which they match the total of whatever the program gives you. Let's say, for example, you only qualify for $200. They match that, they match the $200. And right there, you have $400. So whatever little thing that you have to qualify, it helps you. For the heating system but you need to apply asap as soon as possible for that help okay that's one that's one thing another thing i don't know if y'all know there are tax free out there people that help you agency also 211 because like we live in different type of uh, different places i don't know so I'm gonna to suggest to always look, oh my God, look at my hair. Always call 211, that's all around the world. So 211 could tell you where they're gonna do some tax free. Don't pay nobody $100, $150 to do your taxes. I mean, if you have a lot of things that you need to put on your taxes, hey, you do need a reliable, accounting person. That's what I would suggest, okay? To be honest with you, I wouldn't go to a, a agency that you really don't trust, okay? To do something like that. Um, get an accounting, accounting person or an accounting firm. Do your research before you commit and showing them all your papers, because that's your personal life right there. Your papers, your earnings, and everything. That is your personal life right there. So you don't want to show that to anybody. Do your research. And how you do your research, ask them. Ask the agency. I want reviews of people that you have um, did their their taxes, I would like to know their response. Yes, do your research. That's what I would encourage y'all to do. If you have a lot of things that y'all need to put on your taxes, okay? But if it's a simple tax form that you don't have a lot of deduction to make, then go to these free agency that does help I have been doing it for a couple of years already and they are 
truly, truly good people and they know what they're doing. Up to now, I haven't had any problem. So, and what I do is that I call a 211 and they set all the appointment that I have to make, okay? As a matter of fact, I just called them a couple days ago and I already have my appointment set, set for next month. So, that's number two of information. Whew. When you talk and you're doing exercise, you get a short, short of breath. And then this girl right here, this girl right here, she's a little bit overweight, but who's counting? I'm not counting, no, no. Because you know what, I feel beautiful. The way I am, I feel beautiful. Do I want to be healthy and healthier? Of course, but I'm not gonna deprive me of having a little bar snack, a little ice cream, no. I go ahead and I eat that ice cream, that sneaker bomb, even if I have to then do some more exercise. Oh. Because for me, I just want to be a little bit more stronger in my bones. That's all. Let me raise this a little bit more. The speed. Chatting with you, I already done 10 minutes already. See how time flies. Time flies, yes. You go out there. And we do have a TV in here that I could turn on. And that can make it a little bit more easier for me to make time pass but I don't use it. If they had a music channel, I probably would turn it on, but I don't think that they have a uh, music channel in the TV in here. <laughs> oh, Wanda, you're asking too much now. Nah, I don't ask for those things. I thank God for the place where I live. I really do love where I live. To me, it's my palace, it's my kingdom, you know. Where I could feel safe and secure. Nothing beats that, then you could, you know, go to sleep and feel secure, come in and out, if you're secure. Because something happened, yes, something could happen, anything could happen. But that's where you as a person, you gotta be vigilant. I hope I'm saying that the proper way, you know, of your surrounding. You know, when you go out, when you come back, back in to any place, you know, any place that you're at, at the store, visiting your family, you just have to be aware of your surroundings. That's all. You know, and who cares if you be looking towards your back every five minutes and there's people in back of you and they might think that you're crazy. Let them think that you're crazy. You're just protecting yourself. Yes, I do it. No shame in here whatsoever. Huh? Check under, under your cars and back of your car. Yeah, before you get in. <laughs> People think that I'm probably crazy, but no, no. I, I do it here and I have camera all around this building. And like I said, I feel secure, but you never know. Don't ever underestimate, you know, and this part, like I'm talking about security, don't ever underestimate your secureness that you feel, okay? Because you can know about yourself, but you never can know your surroundings. So I myself, when I go downstairs, I check 
back and front. And from walking from far, I see under my car if somebody is hiding there. Yes. And I don't care whoever thinks, wow, this lady is crazy, you know. No, I, you know what? I really don't care if they think that, you know. In the store, I do the same thing too. From far, I be checking my car. My eyes are straight to my car. And if I see something wrong, um, I'll just act like I'm going to another car, another area. Then I turn around and see. Okay, yeah, that's what I do. That's another tip, okay. Oh, you in a row, Wanda. And you probably already know this, but sometimes we forget those tips, you know. Um, sometimes we just need some reminders because we take life as, oh, nothing is gonna happen, but you never know. Life is too precious and we need to be secure and be knowledgeable, okay? So this crazy lady, like I said, in this channel, it's all about life skills. Yes, of everything. Makeup, exercise, being crazy, crazy cat lady, yeah, with Jasper, yeah. Some laughing, yeah, laughing all the way. I might cry, that's okay. I might be emotional, that's okay. I'm human, you're human. The thing is not to stay that way for days and days, no. No judgment, no judgment, okay? And if you do stay like that for a couple of days, please, please call your doctor. Call your doctor and say, I need to talk to you, okay? And talk to him. If he recommends to see a therapist, there's no shame. A counselor, there's no shame. A social worker, there's no shame to go and talk to them, okay? But sometimes even talking to your doctor, if you have a good doctor out there that is willing to listen to you, he or she will listen to you and will guide you to what you need. See, I know how to keep it serious when I need to. Yeah, because I don't know who's seeing these videos. So we got to respect that. You know, I don't want to trigger nobody. No. What I want is for you to laugh and be happy. That when you see Miss Wanda, oh, Wanda has a video. Up, oh, subscribe, like, share, and hit the notification so when I upload, y'all be informed, okay? So like I was saying, you know, I gotta be courteous to those people that are seeing my YouTube. No, I want them to be happy and laugh and be motivated, that's all. But motivating also could be saying things that we don't want to hear. Because sometimes we don't want to hear things that in the end will benefit you. So I just want you to listen and take what is good what you hear that is good, that touch you in your heart, and just listen to that, okay? Let me stop yapping because I could yap, I could talk, <laughs> I could talk a storm. And I don't remember if I said my name is Wanda, I think I just, I did, I did. Oh, Wanda, you're forgetting, you're forgetting. And remember, drink some water, okay?
just a little bit. Just to wet your, your lips, you know. Fifteen minutes already. Yes. Ooh. Yes, Wanda. And you can tell I'm all ready. When I walk outside in the community with my sisters or my friend, they could sweat. <laughs> and when I say sweat, they be like really with sweat. And they look at me like, Wanda, you're not sweating. <laughs> And it is true, I do not sweat. For whatever reason, I do not sweat like that. The only thing that you could see is my whole face turning red. And I could sweat just a little bit, just a little bit um, down, but that's, that's, that's a little bit. Nothing that I have to um, bring a cloth, nope. So, is that good or bad? I don't know, I'm not no doctor. <laughs> no judgment here, okay? <laughs> but it's true. I'm keeping it 100%. Ooh, that heart monitor is way high. Ooh. <laughs> That's good. Because what you want, you want your blood to circulate all your body. You want your heart to beat? Well, for me, I want my heart to beat a little bit faster, just a little bit. Out of the norm, norm okay? Nothing that I'm gonna expose myself and get a heart attack, <laughs> no. Especially if you're here by yourself, okay? Even though I have the security, the red security button that stopped, I have it attached to my shirt. And if y'all in a gym, that's another hint. If y'all in a gym that has that security code that you could put it, place it on you, that cord, if you fall down, it automatically stops whatever that you're doing, okay? If you're in a, the, the, the walking print mill. So I'm gonna bring my, my walking a little bit slower just to relax my heart. Cause I already been here 15 minutes. I could go to 15 more minutes, but I choose not to. Okay? Because I'm keeping it real with y'all, 100% real. So I'm bringing it down. My eye, eye climb, well, I don't know if I'm saying it right, no judgment. I had it at number four. So now it's a number 1.0 with the speed of two. Because I just want to relax my heart. Bring it to a normal. Because I don't want this video to be long. But I do want y'all to know that I'm keeping it 100%, I don't want you to ever doubt me whatsoever. And if y'all doubt me, that's okay too. <laughs> that's okay. This right here, this is what I'm talking. See, just attach it. If it bothers you and your shirt right here, to me it does, so I put it under, underneath, okay? Drink some water. 
I'm going to clean it. Do some stretching also. Do stretching before and do stretching after you finish your workout, okay? Whatever intense it is, even if it's just on your own pace, like me, on my own pace, I still do that. So, but my stretching today is going to be like cleaning all this out, okay? They supply us with cleaning. I really target the area that I touch, which is the handle. Ooh, see my face is red. <laughs> this inspire you to just get out even if it's walk around your neighborhood around your block area be careful if you do that um, I don't know if your area is snowing or not uh, make sure that the platform is secure the sidewalk um, is not slippery for you to walk and if you can't go outside do it in your house you can do a lot of walking in your house and that's totally free, okay? Just move your body however y'all want to do it. I'm just giving out suggestion, okay? No judgment in here. Drink lots of water. Remember y'all beautiful, blossom as a butterfly or a flower, whichever one y'all like and y'all prefer. Remember, you have family out there that loves you, friend that loves you, and you got this, okay? The most important person to me that I know that he loves me 100% is God. 100% is the man upstairs, I call him God. Um, we gotta respect every religious. You call them, call whoever is your spiritual. You call them the way you wanna call him and respond to him, okay? So take care, be bold, be unique, be true to yourself, and be kind to yourself, and love yourself, okay? Bye-bye. And if y'all stay with me, please remember to, to, to subscribe, share, like, and hit the notification. Bye. Take care, you got this. And welcome to the family, peace.